we are delighted to introduce you to Stoke College, situated in the village of Stoke by Clare on the Suffolk, Essex, Cambridgeshire borders. As you view this video, we hope you'll see that Stoke College is a school where the pupils are nurtured to bring out their best in whatever potential skills they may have, be it academic, musical, dramatic or sporting. This is achieved by caring staff working with small classes in a safe, attractive, spacious rural setting. Stoke College was the name given to the College for Secular Priests, created in 1415 at the Benedictine Priory, which had itself been founded in 1090. Parts of the original Norman cloisters still remain. The College was dissolved in 1548, and the buildings went into family use, the latest of which was that of Lord and Lady Loch. The architect Lutchens was the uncle of Lady Loch, and it was he who designed various rooms and the walled gardens, which are part of the character of the school to this day. The school, founded in 1951, moved to the present site in 1954, from when it has thrived and expanded. At Stoke College, we aim to provide the broad and balanced education and skills necessary for children leaving school to be part of the modern world. The national curriculum is followed through the key stages and children sit the externally marked SATs. In the junior school, younger pupils start with basic learning and move on to include broader skills. The stimulating environment created by the class teacher helps to lay the foundation for future success. Later, children are introduced to subject specialists in specific areas such as geography, history, science, music, ICT and physical education, while French is taught from the youngest class in the junior school. Senior school pupils are taught exclusively by subject specialists but they still have a form tutor who monitors academic and pastoral matters and acts as an interface between home and school. GCSE students follow a broad and balanced program which in addition to core subjects offers opportunities in art, geography, history, ICT, design technology, Spanish, drama, music and physical education. We have particular strength in our science and in our design technology facilities with their own purpose-built classrooms. The results are shown in the high percentage of A grades achieved at GCSE in these subjects. Projects from recent GCSE design technology candidates were chosen as exemplars by the examinations board. As you can see from the graph, our overall results at GCSE are well ahead of the national average and continue to improve year by year. The school has a specialist learning development unit. This is used by about a quarter of the pupils for one or more sessions a week to help to learn strategies to strengthen their reading or writing skills. As a result, students with, for example, dyslexia regularly succeed as well in their exams as their peers or better. It should be clear that a Stoke College education places high but realistic expectations on pupils. This also applies to moral standards and discipline. We have a whole school behaviour policy which clearly lays down expectations about behaviour, while the personal social education programme delivered by form tutors helps pupils to develop a sound moral basis. Drama and music provide an exciting and important focus in the life of pupils and staff at Stoke College. There are many opportunities each year for the pupils to perform in the main school productions. Recent productions have included Godspell, Bugsy and Grease.
There are few schools where there is a chance for youngsters to find their musical potential. However, at Stoke, music is so popular that up to 80% of pupils have lessons from visiting music teachers. The school has its own performing arts building, where there is a hall for performances as well as music classrooms and practice rooms. What the pupils enjoy is that Stoke College music is for the young at heart and they have great fun and skill, whether playing solo or in groups. Recent concerts have included Tubular Bells, Graceland and Abbey Road. It's not only in the arts that our pupils have the opportunity to find themselves. Sport is important at both individual and team levels. Throughout the year, junior school pupils have swimming lessons once a week, in the winter months at the nearby Haverhill Swimming Pool. We have our own heated swimming pool which is used by the whole school through the summer. We are well set up for cross-country running and annually host inter-school events. In individual sports, our pupils are regular winners at East Anglian and National ISA cross-country, athletics and swimming events. Team games such as soccer, rugby, hockey, cricket, tennis, badminton and netball are played alongside the individual sports. Pupils are encouraged to enjoy simply taking part or to perform at the highest level, including taking part in fixtures against local schools or at regional and national levels, where again our teams regularly come out the winners. To help bring your son or daughter to and from school, we run minibus services from both the Cambridge and Sudbury directions, with convenient pick-up points en route. After school, we can offer a prep club and also a tea club, as well as various hobby clubs for those pupils with working parents who would prefer to return home rather later in the afternoon. Weekly boarding from Monday to Friday provides busy families with further opportunities. The pupils benefit from supervised prep and a wide range of leisure activities offered on site. Weekly boarding encourages independence, unselfishness and a spirit of friendship which will stand the boarders in good stead throughout their lives. We feel it's important that Stoke pupils should have extracurricular links with the outside world into which they will eventually go. These activities include a week's work experience while they are in year 10, where the student is seconded to a local business. There are annual ski trips, most recently to France and North America, and activity holidays such as sailing, canoeing, climbing. There are regular one-day trips, for example to the theatre at Stratford-on-Avon to see The Lion, The Witch and the Wardrobe, or to the Tate Gallery in London. A camp is set up each year in the depths of Thetford Forest by years 7 and 8. Our pupils participate in local music and drama festivals such as those held in Ipswich and Sudbury. Our staff's ability to find each pupil's strengths and make the most of them is one of the most notable features of the school. Alongside this, the children get to know in a balanced way who they are and what it is they can reasonably achieve in life. Social skills develop well. 
We encourage all pupils to take responsibility for themselves, to be independent, and to have sufficient confidence to take the initiative when needed. We encourage all pupils to share, care and enjoy friendships while engendering tolerance and an ability to be self-assessing. We aim to help each pupil achieve at the highest level to which he or she is capable. Along the way we challenge and expose them to the broad education that they will need to tackle life after school. I think everybody gets to know everybody when it's a small group. Um, if you know everybody, you feel more confident. So. <coughs> yeah, your confidence does rise. Yeah. Um, mm. But if you, if you put into an activity that, you know, as you said, maybe just thrown in, you might not have thought, oh, maybe I don't want to do that, you know, a bit embarrassed. But if they say, no, come on and do it, and you get into it, you start enjoying it and you have a good time. Yeah, definitely. There's so many uh, extra activities you can do, um, and you learn to work in a team or. Uh, you learn so many different skills rather than just being in a classroom and being given a, something to do, you know. And our marvellous school was so big, like, you didn't have any, any attention paid to you, really, because so many people, and they didn't really have the time because everyone was rushing about. It was just smaller now, and it's just, I don't know. Yeah, I suppose it has boosted my confidence as well, like that. It's amazing, and I'm so much more confident now. Um, and just everyone sticks by you, you don't have to do it by yourself. Because everyone's there, you're not on your own. In the state school, you're on your own, and and yeah, the tiniest bit of help from the teachers I found. But here, it's just everybody's with you, and everybody's on your side, and it's great. It's a great atmosphere as well. I went to um, another school, and the kids aren't as well sociable as they are here. With um, especially well, with each other and with the staff, the staff are a lot closer here. Yeah. And if you have a mm -hmm. problem or if you need to talk to someone about it. You, you can you feel you can you know find yourself in the teachers. So <coughs> yeah. and from doing um, extra curricular activities or going on trips or whatever, you your relationship with the teachers and you know it gets a bit more close. Yeah. 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 They actually want unlike the state school, they know us like individually instead of like if you've got a class of thirty two or forty. Um, but because we've got smaller classes, the teachers tend to know us more like in, on an individual basis. If I went to a school in Colchester closer to me, then um, then I wouldn't get the individual kind of help with um, the subjects that I find difficult. And the um, the college, the sort of private buses we have helps a lot because my mum doesn't have to drive me so far and everything. So and yeah. To come for the music, <coughs> the music facilities were much better in, in this school than they were in the other schools. There's a lot of things you can do and you can do with sport, and there's a huge variety of things you can do with music. You can go to classical music and you can use modern music as well. Right, I'm really looking forward to it because if, you, if you're only 11, you get loads more privileges. Like, um, I'm not just sure because I've got a friend who's boarding, she's told me all about everything. And you get a, a, ho a homeroom sort of just for the year 11s and there's only going to be four of us and it's going to be very long. And there's after school activities where you can go in the hall and play around and then in the summer time you can come out and use the outdoor facilities. There's so many um, different things you can do here rather than coming from a primary school with like no music facilities and things like that. Um, I've started drama lessons and music lessons and we hope this video and our prospectus have given you a taste of the strengths and values that Stoke College can offer. However, don't just take our word for it. Take advantage of our personalised trial day. Your son or daughter can spend a day in the class he or she would join and get a feel for the individual attention and personal interest offered in our small classes. We're also able to make an assessment based on the work done on the day. Don't you agree that this looks just the education you've always wanted for your child? We look forward to welcoming you to the world of Stoke College.